In this connection, I want to stress once more the special military operation in the Ukraine and Donbas, which started uh, in February. All the objectives will be definitely carried out to guarantee the security of people in the Donetsk and Lugansk People's Republic, the Russian Crimea, and all our country. We must understand that our soldiers and officers uh, have prevented a real threat which was hanging over our motherland. With their courage, resoluteness, and heroism, they prevented, prevented a large-scale conflict which would uh, spread on our territory according to other people's scenario. The forces which have historically contained uh, Russia, historically contained uh, in olden times, you, uh, too, you know this very well, such an independent. Why did they do that? Because uh, such an independent, huge country, they don't need such a country. They think that it's uh, just by existing, it presents a threat to them, even though it's not true. They present a threat to the whole world themselves. We remember the plans of uh, the fascists uh, against the Soviet Union to, uh, uh, to make people who uh, can work, force that those people work to be slaves, and those who uh, couldn't work uh, should go to Siberia and uh, die there. That was a historical document. We remember this document. We also remember how Western states at the beginning of the 1990s and uh, 2000s uh, encouraged international terrorists and bandits in North Caucasus, how they speculated on the problems of our past. And, uh, of course, uh, there were those were problems and the injustices in relation to uh, whole nations, uh, whole peoples in the Caucasus, for example. But they didn't do that to improve us, uh, not at all. They did that so that uh, they could move uh, the problems of the past into our today's life, to encourage uh, separatist moods in our country, and uh, finally to split it and to destroy it. That's why they did that. And finally to push us uh, into to a corner, into a bear's corner. In the past, many tried to do this against Russia. But they haven't reached their objective, but they didn't reconcile with this, with this failure. They didn't reconcile with the fact that despite uh, their onslaught, we held out. That's why later they began to prepare an economic war against Russia. Step by step, step they used any excuses, and sometimes even without any excuses, they implemented new sanction restrictions. And even today's uh, plans to strengthen us economically have failed. In this connection, our country's enemies forced the creation of new geopolitical weapons. They are not really new, but they created a new impulse. They reckoned that Russophobia would do this. They, for years, they turned Ukraine our neighboring Ukraine into anti-Russia. Let's uh, remind you that Russia was also uh, always sympathetic and acted as a friend and as a comrade, as a, a, a brother. It uh, viewed the creation of the independent Ukrainian state. At the time, we expected that this would be a friendly country that we would uh, develop together uh, and strengthen each other and uh, create uh, the best uh, uh, conditions for our competition and uh, development. Yeah. And, uh, of course, uh, we didn't expect that uh, they would create anti-Russia on uh, that territory. We cannot uh, allow this. And, of course, uh, in the end, they uh, caused and uh, pushed Ukraine to have a direct confrontation in our country, like uh, the military attacks uh, on uh, Donbass and uh, Crimea were in uh, their doctrines, uh, and uh, the Ukrainian people were meant as uh, consumables. And uh, many Ukrainian people are now realizing this, such as uh, the Kiev's regime, uh, the, its desire to have nuclear weapons and the creation of uh, biological labs uh, and uh, the 
supply of uh, latest uh, weapons to Ukraine. All that confirms that our reaction to all that was uh, timely and correct. Esteemed colleagues, I want to stress once more, our soldiers and uh, officers and uh, the militia of Donbass are carrying out their missions uh, heroically. All the objectives that have been set will be carried out.